Bombshell after bombshell emerged during Oprah Winfrey's historic interview with the Sussexes. One such instance was when Meghan Markle said, the latter, when asked if she had been, quiet, or were you hushed. Meghan talked candidly about her feelings of voicelessness as a working member of the royal family and her strong desire for independence. As stated by the Express News revealed that although it was widely, believed that Meghan had revealed her feelings of voicelessness as a royal for the first time at this point in the 2021 interview, another author asserts that the Duchess had already voiced her displeasure with feeling voiceless and devalued for many years earlier that I in 2020. Mail on Sunday journalist Sarah Sands stated that Meghan Markle allegedly said, Do not I have a voice, during a function with her husband, Prince William. And Princess Kate. The episode allegedly took place during a show that featured the four royals, who were known as the Fab Four at the time. The author claims that William gave Kate the microphone, which she then gave to Meghan's husband Harry, then, Sarah says, Meghan, icily, questioned, Do not I have a voice? Those near enough to hear her presumably overheard her whisper the inquiry beneath her breath. Sarah states, Meghan believed that her voice had been silenced during her ordeal in Britain. The microphone moved down the queue, William, Kate, Harry, Meghan, at the end of the queue, not wanting to wait. A colleague who attended a program featuring the short-lived Fab Four of the royal family remarked on how heartwarming it is to remember the two couples looking so happy together. She remarked coldly, Do not I have a voice? At a royal engagement with Prince William and Kate, Meghan Markle wonders, Do not I have a voice? As a working member of the royal family, Meghan talked candidly about how much she cherished her independence and how she felt like she could not express herself. At last, she can be heard, loud and clear, Sarah continues, referring to Meghan and Harry's Netflix partnership. Her apparent happiness at being home again is evident. In 2020, the two announced an unprecedented £130 million contract in which they will produce series and documentaries for the massive US streaming service. When their six-part documentary about their romance and royal departure debuted on the streaming service, it quickly rose to the top of the viewership rankings. But it is said that the pair, who are currently residents of California, neglected to tell the late queen of their intentions. The Sun was informed by a royal insider that the Queen was left to learn about the couple's new endeavor from her staff. Harry did not alert the Queen about the Netflix contract, the person stated. Furthermore, the source stated that the Queen would have valued the inability to talk the Duke and Duchess out of the plans, knowing her grandson Harry as she does.